Hi, I'm Jeff Taylor, manager of Phoenix Pro Shop, located in Ten Pin Alley in Fitchburg, Wisconsin. I ask a lot of questions. Are they experienced? Do they have current equipment and what is their current bowling ball? What their average is? They're bowling in league. What weight of ball they're using? What they're thinking of? Has anybody in their league or on their team recommended a bowling ball? How fast they they roll the ball, uh, how much revolutions, what kind of reaction and look hook they're looking for in the ball. And then I discuss different bowling ball types that they're looking for in that range. I then ask about the fit, uh, recommending the fingertip fit is the most modern, common way, uh, potential for the higher scoring and the most potential out of your game. And then I measure them up accordingly with, their, with that fit. The, the fingertip fit has your hand in the ball longer with the thumb out, which helps you get more revolutions on the ball. It's similar to throwing a football or shooting a basketball. You get the revolutions and the spin on the ball from the fingertips. You know, the biggest difference with a bowling ball in the sport with bowling is you actually put your hand into the ball. No other sport I know of has you actually put holes in the ball where you have the fingers in the ball. So it's very, very important to get a nice, comfortable fit for the for the person rolling the ball, so they don't, you know, they they can bowl longer. They don't have any injuries or or pain, which is the frustration part of trying to find a ball out on the lanes. Is there's not everybody's hand is unique, and different. So when they come in here, they ex they get that experience. They they get that aha moment when they put their hand in the ball. Go, wow, this is, this feels great. And that, to me, that's like, that's a lot of satisfaction I get. You want, you want the hand to be comfortable laying flat on the ball, but at the same time you want your fingers to be able to fit into the ball without any extra extraneous strain. And then I also bend your fingers so I know which way they, they bend so I can have the pitches laterally, and also how flexible you are so it's forward and back on the fingers. Thumb, same thing. Then I mark the, mark the bowling ball and drill the holes. What we do is we have more thumb slugs rather than just drilling the hole into the ball. You have different textures and different com compositions inside the ball. A urethane thumb slug has the same texture throughout. It can also be a little smoother. You don't have the um, sweats or oils from your, from your thumb that collect in the ball. It's cleaner and it's more consistent. So if you get another ball or other balls, you'll have that same feel because you have that same thumb slug in each ball. Sometimes uh, with reaction with the balls, the cover stock is very, very important as to how much your ball hooks or not hooks. Uh, the duller, more matte finish, the ball tends to grab a little earlier. So it'll you make sure it'll hook it hooks soon enough. Other times it may hook early but then it's spent and doesn't have the energy to hook on the back end and that's where we want to polish the ball give it a little more shine to it so it'll slide down the lane further before saving the hook potential till the back end okay, the modern the modern bowling ball has very heavy weight blocks inside the bowling ball so what i do is the people like to have a lot of hook in the ball so you offset the weight block you get it more to one side of the ball and the other where you drill the holes. So it helps the ball hook and drive into the pins more strong and you get more pin action that way. I want this to be a pleasant experience. I want, I love the game, I love the sport. I want everybody else to enjoy it. It's something anybody can do. I picked it up when I was very, very young in kindergarten. I loved it. You don't have to be very big. You don't have to be very strong. You don't have to be fast. You don't have to be any super special athletic person to be very, very good and excel in this sport. And you can do it throughout your whole life. As long as you can grab a ball, swing it, and release it, you can bowl.